making the headline. Ever traditional folk musician Serum Day, known in showbiz circles as Serum Music, is calling on the tourism ministry to institute a scheme and sponsorship package to promote the creative works of existing and budding musicians. He also wants the sector minister to set up a committee to audition new artists to identify vocalists and support them to grow and shine. At an event in Accra, Sarah Music said his style of music is intended to project his mother tongue and culture. He says his aim is also to revive the old forgotten contemporary song. During my album production, I spent some time to visit the various towns in the Volta region to to, have, uh, to relate or collaborate with the local bands and, and artists. And I realize the numerous talents we have, you know, even better than me, you know, but you don't have anyone to help. Music and language, he said, is an integral part of culture and that people are lost when they have lost their cultural identity. Sarah Music says his songs are dedicated to all Volterians, particularly the people of Peki and Vitili, from where his roots are. <laughs> The Vroom album, he stands for Volta Region's organically original music, with his headline, Road to Ewe Nyimba, referred to as the journey to my motherland, a mixture of Ewe and English language, is meant to promote, project the cultural identity and heritage of the people of Peki Avetile and the Volta region. Apart from projecting the culture of Peki Avetile indigenous, Room albums to highlight and promote contemporary Ewe folk music to modern audiences. Having spent over seven years in the music industry and launching his second album, Room, which has 16 tracks. Serum Day, known in private life and in showbiz circles as Serum Music, said he is determined to rise to the height of his career. Tourism Minister Mr. Mohamed Ahwa lent his support to the initiative and said Ghana's creative arts should be developed to put Ghana high up on the international tourism map. And that's all we have for news for now. Thank you so much for watching. We'll be back at 10.30 with our final news bulletin for the day. And to then enjoy the rest of our programs coming up is Talking Point.